My name is Damien Abrahams. I'm a mental health therapist at Kudot Lake School. I am a single father of one daughter. Um, I'm also a Haida. I come from the northwest coast of British Columbia. Um, I came to Edmonton about 17 years ago and I've been living here ever since. Um, I went to school at Concordia and uh, graduated in 2013 and I've been working with uh, high-risk youth ever since and it's been a passion of mine for my whole life basically. When I was in, I think when I was in grade four or five I had a youth worker, uh, he drove um, a burgundy colored Suzuki Swift and um, he worked with me every every week, two times a week he'd come and we'd hang out. Um, he actually brought me to my very first Canucks game. He, we lived in Mission at the time and um, we, we, he drove all the way out to Vancouver so we can go to this hockey game. And that was the first time I thought doing what he's doing is pretty cool. And when I grew up, I was trying to decide what I wanted to do and, and he came to mind and I thought like I could do that and um, that was my end goal for when I was going to school was to work with youth. My biggest achievement so far is um, just graduating university. Um, I come from a family who has not gone to school. Um, well, I do have my, my grandmother who has her master's in education. Uh, but she's the only other one who's gone to post-secondary. Um, so just graduating university uh, as a non-parent achievement and obviously as a parent, having my daughter and, and raising her as the best that I can is one of my other biggest achievements. My biggest failure is um, not being there for the last five years of my great-grandmother's life. Um, when I was a child, she was my best friend and she was always there for me whenever I needed her. And even when I moved out to Ontario, she came all the way out to Ontario just to visit me. And uh, I was too caught up in the street life, drugs, whatever. Um, and I missed out on the last five years of her life. My favorite quote is I think it's less of a quote and more of a mantra and that is here and now and that comes from a book a series of books that I read uh, the first one is way of the peaceful warrior and the book states that we're whatever you're going through uh, whatever challenges that you're facing it's best to be here and now it's not the important part is focusing on the here and now and not what you're going to get from facing these. And the more you stay in the here and now, the more you can accomplish in life.